Hi guys, I'm Ashish from Guiding Tech and in today's video I'm going to show you how to access the shared content of a folder on Windows on your iOS device. So let's see how it's done. Now before we begin, there are the, if you have any doubts regarding how you can share a folder with all its content on Windows 7 or Windows 8, you can have a look at the video that we have previously covered. If you don't have a Wi-Fi router at your disposal, there's a trick on how you can actually broadcast a virtual Wi-Fi hotspot from your laptop. We have already covered a video for the same as well that you can have a look on. So we'll be using the file browser app for the task which will which is available on the app store now the app is available for both free and paid version the light version can be used to test the app for free while the paid version is available for around approximately six US dollars so after you install the app open it up and tap on the add server button on the top right hand side here select PC and type in the IP address of the computer to which you want to connect to. Once you have done that, select the username and password. Now I don't use any username or password, uh, so I'll be keeping it blank. Finally give a display name to your PC. It is It can be helpful if you have many PCs that are configured on the same app. After you save, an icon will appear on the home screen tap on it to open the shared folders that are on that particular PC. Now here tap on any folder to open the contents. As you can see I have an mp3, a video and a document file. So first of all let's try to open a document file. Now secondly I'll play a song. Now as you can see that all the mp3 files that are available in the folder will be uh, enqueued in that particular player you can play them finally let's try an HD video now one thing to note here is the high definition video needs time to buffer on the network so it really depends upon the network speed uh, the connectivity speed you have you can also uh, open the video in other apps like VLC if you have uh, installed them on your phone. Now there are many other uh, options available for each file type that you can select from the app itself. You can open it in other app, directly email the attachments or open the file as a text viewer. On the audio side, you can uh, play it on a full screen or email them or just enqueue them into your default player. Apart from just PC, there are many other uh, cloud storage accounts you can connect and use this particular app on. So that was all about how you can access shared folders from Windows onto your iOS device. The file browser app really makes it simple to access the shared file on from Windows or any other device you have onto your iOS. If you have any doubts, you can ask them in the comment section. And I always say, share, like and subscribe. Thank you for watching.